Hi, so welcome to part two of the uh, uh, appreciating stage of for my uh, perfect grade unicorn. And in this uh, video, we will be doing the uh, base color. So I, I just finished the appreciate uh, and it's all dry, so we can apply the uh, base color, which I'm gonna use uh, XF80 for this one, royal gray. Okay. Now, for me, this is the most easiest part of uh, this painting process uh, because you just have to uh, uh, cover the entire piece with the paint um, and then you just have to carefully uh, blend the colors from the side uh, to make it a, a subtle change. Okay, and then we're going to apply the uh, post shade and the highlights. Okay, so let's get started. First, you just carefully paint through the entire piece. And after that, after you paint the entire piece, you're going to uh, uh, control the airflow or the paint flow of the brush, of the airbrush, and you just uh, slightly uh, blend the, uh, the base color to the pre-shade. So I'm just gonna carefully control the trigger of the airbrush. Of course, you don't want to cover your pre-shade with a base color because that will render it useless. Alright, so uh, there you go. Uh, as you can see, there is a subtle change or of the shade of the gray, uh, royal light gray to the dark sea gray. Uh, hope you can see it on camera. Alright, so after this, I'm gonna go for the uh, post shade. Um, so here are two pieces of the shield, okay, 
and also just for comparison here's the uh, piece that is only pre-shaded okay so i'll see you in the next video